Hello, my name's Jane Sharp. I've written a poem about bog snorkelling. Painted the picture too. For those of you who don't know anything about bog snorkelling, I'll tell you a little. In 1976, a man called Gordon Green got together with a few of his mates in the pub to decide how to bring more tourism to a place called Clanoted Wells in Wales. They came up with this idea of bog snorkelling and it's now an international sport. There are a few rules to bog snorkelling. Um, mainly, you're not allowed to use any known swimming strokes, as in, you know, or you've got to use doggy paddle and rely on flipper power. And swimming like this, you go 60 foot down a, a channel of water cut into the hillside and 60 foot back. And it's the one that does it in the fastest speed gets the trophy. Now, my poem is designed to um, give you that experience without actually getting wet. It's called Virudi Ranum, the green frog at Clanoted Wells. Right. Snorkel mask down, tournament ready, freddy cap over ears, wetsuit emblazoned with arms, the green frog, Viridi Ranum. No braver amphibian ever. Going in. Dunk like a Jamie Dodger into cold Cambrian bog tea. I see as the Celtic cadre, rank as witch's brew. And there's my Idris on the bank waving his bottle of Bloodwin. Yoo-hoo! There's cheering and yelling and clapping and ringing and drumming and clacking and flippers start flapping, flopping, splashing, splashing, splishing, swishing, swamping, gurgling, gushing, galumphing, and I'm out of breath. And yes, there's Superman, lips to his bottle, supping his bloodwin while I'm crawling, trawling, belly flop flopping, dragging a fringe of tangled up bogweed, foaming, frothing, floundering, flagging and fingers feeling like clogged up paddles, snorkel. <sighs> Men. Dove or dog dare them. Halfway there then. Divert the pain. Google. In the same time it takes to boil an egg, you can create your own disco ball. <laughs> snorkel. <sighs> Google. Travelling at 40 kilometres an hour, it takes a kangaroo one minute, 30 seconds to travel one kilometre. <laughs> Snorkel. <laughs> and then there's me. And then there's this bog. And I'm a green frog. Viridi Ranum. Swimming like a beetle in a gunged up gutter. Moving with a flip flop flop flip flutter. Limbs limp and lagging in a slop of minestrone. Paddling through a sheep dip trough of murky slime. A mucky mop of sphagnum. Black as almazine. And at this very moment, I want to say, Bog off, Gordon Green. Snorkel. <laughs> but then, through a soft sucking sound of silence, comes trumpeting and rattling and cheering and yelling and clapping and clanging and I'm rising out of the depths like a triumphant amphitrite, conqueror of oaks, oak druid fluid, defender of frogs and a dollop of dribbling dung. As I scramble up the bank, my man gives me his empty bottle before slip sliding into the reeds. He blows me a kiss fixes his snorkel and disappears down the 60-foot channel, a beaver on speed. And later, in the bar, all oh, hooper-decked, we embrace our madness, celebrate frogs, sing, guide me, O oh, thou great redeemer, green, green grass of home, men of harlock. Bog snorkeling. It's a crazy scene. I love you really, Gordon Green. <laughs>